Hi, I'm Karen Hauer and welcome to the Renourish 20 Minute Workouts. Many of you know me for dancing, but I'm also a personal trainer. We have a series of 10 Renourish workouts which are easy to follow, all focusing on fitness, toning, and strength, which can be found on the Renourish app. Showed up, day one before the glow up. Don't need ask for them. Okay guys, so let's start out with a nice little warm-up before we get into working our butt butts, our bum bums, whatever you like to call them. Um, let's squat it down nice and smoothly, bring your arms up, make sure your feet are slightly wider than your hips and making sure that you're sitting all the way back and reaching all the way up. Nice and smoothly, swift movements, breathing nice and gently, stretching it out, breathing, getting those legs and those glutes going, breathing in and out. Let's do a couple of these, breathe. Do not ever hold your breath, okay? Nice and smoothly. It's about getting that blood flow going, getting ready to start a nice little workout. Good, let's do two more. Nice and smooth, breathe, good. Last one, and rest, good. And from here, we're just gonna take a nice little lunge from side to side. Again, just sitting back into those heels Keeping your abdominals lifted, chest up, making sure you're not dropping your shoulders down. Open up that chest, long spine. Keep your feet nice and sturdy on the ground, okay? Again, legs nice and wide, and it's just a nice little movement from side to side. Nothing crazy, nothing big. Again, it's just creating more mobility in your body, shifting from side to side. Let's do two more, just like this. Good, and one more rest, good. And from here, we're just gonna go from side to side. Breathing, again, nice and gently. Trying to jerk anything. It's just a nice little warm up to get yourself moving. Breathe, good. Now you can take your time with these, or you can go at my speed, whatever feels comfortable for your body. Right, let's keep going, let's do two more. Two, and one, good. And then last one, we're just gonna kick back. Again, keeping a soft, soft knee edge. And I'm sorry, Betty, you okay? Soft knee, again, chest nice and lifted, and just shifting your weight from one side to the other, trying to kick yourself in the butt butt. Breathing, shaking those arms out. Breathe, it'll also release your quads and your Open up your hip flexors as well, as well as activating your hamstrings and your butt butt that we're gonna be doing lots of. All right, let's do four, three, two, and one. All right, let's get started. All right guys, we're gonna start out with some reverse lunges into a kick, okay? We're gonna be alternating. So you're gonna, have, you're gonna start with your feet together, you're gonna step back with your left, kick, and then bring it back to the center, step back with your right, kick, and back to the center, okay? Again, nice and easy, making sure you keep your knees slightly soft, chest nice and lifted, long spine, keep that weight on your front leg, okay? Anytime that you're going, make sure you're not shifting back and forth, putting any pressure on your lower back. We're gonna do 40 seconds work, 20 seconds rest, three rounds, let's hit it. Here we go, nice and easy, back, and you're gonna kick, and then back, back to the center, alternating. Nice little breath, easy does it. Breathe. You know, in these, you can, if you want to use weights, that's completely fine, okay? I like using my own body weight in the beginning, making sure that my balance is nice and still. Nice and easy. Nice distribution of your weight. Good, really hitting that butt, but 10 seconds. Breathe, Woo -hoo. good. Making sure those knees are not going over the toes. Breathing through, last one, and rest. Very nice, good. 
Next one, we're gonna go into a nice little grand plie. Sounds very fancy, but it's pretty much just a squat. Okay, so we're gonna squat and then we're gonna go on our tippy toes while we're squeezing our butt butts, okay? So again, nice and wide position, chest lifted, long spine. Take it down and releve. Take it down and up onto your tippy toes at the same time that you're squeezing that butt butt, keeping that chest lifted, stay nice and aligned. It's gonna also work on your balance, which is great. <sighs> breathe. Sometimes I forget to breathe. But as long as you just keep going at your own pace, nice and smoothly, go as low as you can, as long as you're keeping lovely, lovely, lovely form, okay, and technique. Easy, five seconds, long spine, last one, and rest, very nice. Good, now from here we're gonna go into one of my favorite steps actually, which is a long jump. So we're gonna squat forward, and then we're gonna run it back. Hopefully I won't run into Betty. But we're gonna squat, jump forward, squat, run it back. Jump forward, squat, run it back. In three, two, let's go. Little jump, run it back. Little jump, make sure that you're landing. It's nice and soft, like a cat. You wanna land like a cat. Easy does it. Breathing, make sure that when you land, you're landing all the way back into your heels. Nice and soft. You don't want to make too much noise. Absorb the shock. Breathe. Get it. Pop those little glute glutes. Three seconds. Let's do one more. And rest. Very nice, guys. Good. Now from here, we're going to go into a nice little donkey kicks. We're going to get on all fours. Okay. And we're gonna alternate, kicking back, pushing with that heel, making you believe that you're gonna kick a wall back, okay? Or if you've had a really bad day, make you believe that you're kicking something. <sighs> nice and smooth, alternating, giving a nice little stretch, keeping your abdominals nice and lifted. Make sure you don't release your spine down. Core intact, nice alignment in your shoulders and in your hips. Breathe. Squeeze that butt butt, squeeze that butt. Breathe, Woo. feel that burn. Again, taking your time. If you want to put something underneath your knees, or if you want to use a resistance band for this, that's fine. Three, two, and one. Good, very nice, nice little rest. Good enough from here, I'm just gonna turn the other way. We're gonna do rainbows, okay? So we're gonna do 20 seconds on each leg. We're going around and then coming back. Going around and coming back. What a rainbow looks like. You're going to extend your leg, you're going to bring it to the opposite side of your body, and then bring it all the way around. Tap. Nice and smooth. Again, try, not, try to avoid moving your spine around. You want to keep everything nice and smooth. Good. Breathe. Nice and easy. So we're going to change legs now. Other side. Up and over. Breathe. Good. Make sure everything's staying nice and tight. Nice. Breathe. Woo. That bubble's gonna be burning in the morning, girl. Three, two, and one. Excellent. Good. Now let's take it to the top. Okay. You have your reverse lunges into your kicks. Let's get that part started one more time. Make sure you. You need a little bit more rest, that's fine. You can take a little bit more rest. If not, stay with me, drink some water, breathe, okay? Again, reverse lunges in three, two, one. Let's go, chest lifted, little kick, and back, breathe. Back, kick, down. Nice and smooth, feet. it's all about placing your weight in the correct way that's efficient for you. And then you're not, you know, if you're wobbly, that's fine, okay? A little bit at a time, take your time, breathe, chest open. Okay, you can place your hands wherever it feels more comfortable, even if you have to hold onto a wall, that's completely fine as well. Okay, breathe, woo, and rest. Very nice, all right. 
Okay guys, so the next one we're gonna go into our squat and relevé, as I like to say, so fancy, 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 grand plié and relevé. And keeping that chest nice and lifted, making sure that your spine is not wavering forward or back. Everything's going straight up and down. Okay, nice, but nice and low. And when you get to the top, really squeeze the butt butt. Make sure you don't hyperextend those knees, okay? Nice and lifted, breathe. Good, we have a couple of seconds to go. And nice and smoothly, breathing through it. Take your time, okay? Breathe, pushing through. All right, keep going. That's it. Three, two, and one. Beautiful, good. Take it down, shake it off. Okay guys, we're gonna go into our long jump. Game three, two, let's go. Squat it down. Breathe. And again. Nice and smooth. Again, taking your time with it. Breathing through. Nice and smoothly. Woo! Go as far as you can. Again, making sure that your technique, your form is nice and on point. Nice and smooth. There we go. Breathing through. That's it. Let's do one more. Breathe through it. And rest. Very nice. Good. Love that. Love that. Okay. We're going to take it down into our donkey kicks. Okay. Nice and smooth. Again, making sure you're pushing with that heel straight back. Really activating those glutes. Squeezing everything out. Nice form. Alignment in your upper body. Abs tight. Lower back. Nice and solid. Push it out. And alternate. Breathe. Nice and smooth. That's it, guys. Breathe. Good. Yeah, making sure those hips aren't moving around too much. Keep everything nice and square. Okay. Tummy's in. Breathing through. Nice and smooth. You can hear how I'm shaking. My breath is like, okay, this is not easy. <laughs> nice and smooth. Good. Couple more. Almost there and rest. Good. Shift it around. We're going to go into our rainbows. Again, making sure that you're keeping everything nice and come in place. Okay, no wobbling around. Okay, breathing in in three, two, let's go across, up and over. Breathe. 20 seconds on each leg. Give me a nice half circle, up and over, up and over. Breathing. Try not to move your body around too much. Good. We're going to switch. This is your last one. And switch sides. Breathe. Take it across, up and over. Nice and smooth. Good. Really hitting those glutes. <laughs> Keeping those abs tight. Almost there. Yeah. Good. Three, two, and one. Very nice. Good. All right, guys. Into your last set, okay? Again, we're going to go into our reverse lunges with our kicks. Breathing through. Staying nice and aligned. Okay? You know what you're doing. Now just focus and take your body where it needs to go. In three, two, one. Good, take it back and kick. Nice and smooth. Take it back, really squeeze. Squeeze it in there and back. Breathe, chest lifted. Back, and easy does it. Good, breathe. Back, breathe. 20 seconds, take your time. Make sure you don't drop your upper body at any point. Everything always stays nice and lifted. Good, breathe. Almost there. Push. Good. One more. Oh, good luck. And rest. Very nice. Good. Grand plié into relevé. <sighs> Breathing. Again, keeping those legs nice and wide. Making sure you can get up onto your toes. Long spine, tummy's in, 
ribs in, chest up, long spine, long neck. So many things to think about. One thing at a time though. Take it down. Down, brother. And up. Brother, like squeeze. Okay, boom. Squeeze almost. You almost want to feel like you're zipping, you're zipping up. Everything nice and centered. Good. Chest lift. Breathe. You might lose your balance. That's okay. One thing at a time. Breathing through. And up. And up. And up. Good. Sit two more. And up. Last one. And up. And rest. Very good. Shake it off. Okay. Breathing through everything. We got this. Okay. We're going to go into our long jump. Breathing through, again, making sure you're landing nice and smoothly. You don't want to land too hard, okay? And you can always walk it forward or back, okay? So it's fine. Okay, three, two, let's hit it. Nice little jump. Taking it back. Breathe. Good. Make sure you sit back. Sit back, nice form. Make sure those knees are going, not going over your toes. Breathe. That's it. Almost there. And back. Easy does it. Nice and light. Breathe. Good. Let's do one more. One more, one more. Push. And rest. Very nice. Good. Shake it off. Down to the floor. Almost done here. Almost done. Nice alignment. Breathe, you need to take a second longer, that's completely fine, okay? As long as you're breathing, taking it easy at your own pace, okay? Three, let's push it out. Two, let's go. Keeping those hips nice and square. It can sometimes feel like you want to cheat by bringing it up, but actually, you're just putting more pressure into your lower back. So you're just making sure you have the correct alignment you still get that nice little squeeze when you need it, okay? Breathing through, almost done with this workout. You guys are doing great. Breathe, breathe through it. Nice and smooth. Almost there, five, four, three, two, and one, good. Now, last exercise. Rainbow, so making sure that you are taking that leg up and over. Hi, Betty, come Up and over. I'm just gonna join you for this last one. Let's go, you ready, girl? You ready? And then you are. In three, two, one, up and over. One. 20 seconds on each leg. Breathing through. Nice and smoothly. Up and over. Good. Good. Betty, yeah, that's great. Good. In four, three, Two, you're gonna switch. Nice and easy. Switch to the other side. Let's go up and over. Almost done. Last 20 seconds. Come on, 15 seconds. Keep going, chest lifted. Try not to let your body drop. Abs tight. Almost there, almost there, almost there. Five, four, three, two, and one. Well done, everybody. Well done, guys. Okay guys, let's do a little cool down, a little stretch. Um, let's go into a nice little figure four. Bring your right leg over your left, keeping your chest nice and lifted, spine lifted. You're gonna feel a nice little stretch in your hip rotator, in your glute. Um, this will release those hips as well and release the tension in your, in your little bum bums, okay? Nice way to stretch things out. Breathe in here. Again, make sure, making sure you're not releasing your lower back up. Have, you can you know, get, go against the wall, um, or if you need to release the foot out a little bit more, that's fine, or if you want to bring it in, uh, that's cool too. And release to the other side, other way. Again, really getting that hip, flexing that hip to forward, tilting it forward, like really like the stretch. Really, really, really nice, and you really feel it in your glutes. Breathe, 
and you can stay here for as long as you want. See how your body feels. It's always nice to kind of just listen in, um, see how your body reacts to certain stretches or cool downs. Okay, now from here you're gonna release the legs. You're gonna bring your have your right leg straight. Bring your left leg across. I'm gonna do a nice little little twist. Okay, twist from one side. Again, keeping that chest lifted, spine up, breathe, twisting all the way around as far as you can get, tummies in, long spine. Nice and easy, breathe. And slowly release, switch to the other side. Again, nice and smoothly. Good again, breathe, bringing that hip up and twisting around, tummies in and try to really grab onto that leg and go it all around the spine. Breathe. You feel a nice stretch right in there. You feel it good. You feel your lower back releasing as well. Breathe. Make sure you don't hold your breath ever. Okay, especially if these stretches and these cool down. Just release the body. Okay. Good. Now, Release the leg. So then we're gonna go into child's pose. Breathing, release that lower back. You can have your knees slightly wider than your hips as well. Okay, releasing here, release that lower back. Release that chest, open up that chest, open up that back. Breathe, have a little wiggle around. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Nice and smooth. Good. One more. And slowly release. Awesome, guys. Los Angeles is my I hope you enjoyed my Renourish workout and remember to eat well, exercise, and stay renourished. Oh,